good morning one and all today is a struggle work has got me like all jacked up with my schedule and sleeping so what i have to do is tomorrow and the next day i have to work overnight so somehow i have to figure out how to stay up all night and i tried last night stayed up till 2 a.m that was about as much as my body could handle and uh felt weird to slip like 9 30 today i can't remember the last time i slept that late so hopefully i'll be able to get get to a rhythm at least so i can stay up all night and work but not gonna be last night maybe welcome tonight. to red's home set So technically it's a day off today. Um, Want to give an update on my grass looking here. Definitely the fescue is coming up and you can see the little pieces of clover um, seed that caught. So we might, I'm not gonna jinx myself like last time, but it's supposed to stay in the 80s max. Actually next week I think it's the 70s. Um, so this should, continue to grow and we have some decent rains so maybe in a few weeks this is gonna be all grass cover fingers crossed my little water sprinkler for the chicken deterrent so they don't eat my clover seeds <laughs> that's all i can do but <clears throat> one of the things i, I got recently is a whole bunch of stuff on clearance and uh just stuff around the, the homestead to use well some with some chairs so i've got some building to do i gotta build a this patio heater and my smoker that i got and a chair that i got and like a fire pit that i got and the awesome thing about it you know this is Twelve, thirteen hundred dollars worth of stuff, and they got paid about two hundred, three hundred, yeah, three hundred, four it all. So, only thing that sucks, I have to go get a couple more propane tanks because I only have two. <laughs> so, gotta go get some more to make those work. So, I'm gonna go ahead and get them built today, and uh, then I think I'll do some more uh, mulch dumping. Yeah, mulch dumping. All right.
adding stuff to my garden to get prepared for the spring. I moved this a little bit further apart so I can get a tunnel in here and start growing next year. Um, speaking down. of the garden, I realized I'm going to have some issues with, uh, with squirrels. I've already covered up the holes that were in here, but you can see they're digging, looking for something. Not sure what they're looking for in here, but holes and holes. So what I'll probably end up doing is getting some kind of spray or deterrent thing um, like I have on the chickens or for the chickens for where my grass seed is. And I'll just put it somewhere over there in the garden so it sprays out this way away from the house and hey it'll water the garden at the same time so win-win sure i'll take it you know what i'm gonna make what are you gonna make you, um, oh, <laughs> <laughs> i never know when you have the camera going i have a camera going well anyways <laughs> you gonna cook it's some? not that exciting oh i was just I was just like, I need to cook that smoked sausage and potatoes and onions, so I'm just gonna do that on the sheet pan. Sounds delicious. Okay, cool. I'll eat it. Dump truck, or the dump cart, utility cart. Huge lifesaver. Let me tell you, just hauling stuff today was incredibly easy. I got the rest of the rabbit cages built and brought over here. Uh, so all we gotta do is get the hutch in, and I am officially ready to start breeding rabbits. And something else I learned today um, is about the four-wheeler and why I was having issues with it. Well, remember, I am still fairly new. Uh, there's probably be some people watching this saying, uh, duh. But I didn't know. Four-wheelers don't have alternators. You have to charge the batteries. So, yeah, I went and tested the battery and it was very low charge. And, uh... So I put it on a slow charger and sure enough, uh, once it got up to about 15 volts again, yeah, cranked back up pretty easily, like immediately. So, hey, I learned it and I'll never forget it. Well, today, extremely productive day. Love it. Yeah, that's fine. Let's see, we got that big old tower flame heater thing built fire pit built, Adirondack chair built, and that's what I'm most excited about, smoker built, gonna have to do me a, a brisket or something good, and then after that, we've grabbed the four-wheeler, got about maybe six inches of wood chips, pine needles, just a lot of the chip drop stuff so rabbits 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 oh, eating your kale mm -hmm. get my muddy shovel so cute so what are you doing in here huh She's not letting you have any of the food. Hello, Mr. Logan. Hey. <laughs> Too much. Just let me know and we'll figure something out. Because Logan's going to be... The thing is, once they start middle school, I guess they need a phone. <laughs> Fertilizer source. That's what she was talking about. <laughs> I was like, oh, we're, gonna, we're already there. Fertilizer purpose. Yes. Yeah. And then this will be future garden. Can I just all my scraps in this? <laughs> I don't know. I need to make a compost. Chickens will eat it. <laughs> it has got to get started. <laughs> Leaf blower. Well, all right. The little poo poo. It feels like it's about to rain. It's not supposed to rain yet, but it sure does look like it. I don't know. We'll see. Got to get uh, get the tools in in case it does. But uh, yeah, I guess that's uh, that's it for the day. See you guys.